Hey beautiful people, it's Rakita and I'm back with another video. So in this video, I want to talk to you guys about the Deserve credit card. So if you're looking to get approved for a credit card, this may be a great credit card for you, especially if you're a student, student because it is a student credit card and they do not require a social security number. So if you are not in the United States, in terms of you don't have a social security um, number, but you're a student here, then this may be a great credit card for you. Now, I have some reviews. I want to go ahead and talk about those reviews. And then I also want to talk about two other credit cards that you could possibly get approved for that's comparable to this credit card, if not better, too, because you have an option to build with that company. That means that you don't have to close the credit card out. You can have that, com that credit card forever. So let's get right on into the video. Now, with the Deserve credit card, you can pre-qualify for it and you're not going to get a hard inquiry. So if you pre-qualify for it, now, if they approve you, understand that you will get that hard inquiry, but you can pre-qualify without that hard inquiry. Now, a few benefits from this credit card is that you're going to get the prime stu student on them for a whole year. So you're going to have prime. If you don't have prime, they're going to pay for it for you guys for a whole year. You're going to get 1% cash back on all purchases. And you're going to get cell phone protection, which I think is really great knowing that I'm the one that keep breaking my cell phone, my screen especially. Um, you guys are going to get cell phone protection. So that's one less thing you have to think about. And I just had to get my phone fixed recently. I think it was like $150. So that is really good that they have that cell phone protection. No international, international transaction fees. That's really great because if you're a foreigner and you want to go back wherever you're at, you want to possibly use your card and you don't want to get charged fees. So this is perfect. And no annual fee, which is the best thing of all, the no annual fee. I like credit cards that don't have an annual fee because you can grow with that credit card. When I say grow with the credit card, I mean, you don't have to um, start getting other credit cards. And like, I hate paying annual fee. I got to cancel this card because canceling your card is going to lower your credit score. So I like this card because... You don't have to think about canceling. You can keep that credit card just sitting there and not getting charged any fees, and it won't hurt you. So if you want to go ahead and apply for this credit card, you can simply apply for it. Like I said, you're not going to get that hard inquiry. If you want on trips, you can go ahead and let them know that you're going on a trip so that they'll know that you're going on a trip, and you don't have to worry about your transactions being canceled. I hate it um, when that used to happen to me with my other card. And again, if you don't have a social security number, you don't have to worry. Um, you don't have to have a social security number to apply for this card. Now, they have quite a few reviews down here, so you guys can definitely go ahead and check out these reviews. A few things that I did see in terms of reviews is um, some people said they got approved for the card, and they like that they have the cell phone protection, and they also left other reviews that I want you guys to go ahead and read now. So I'm going to have the reviews here on the screen so that you guys can definitely check them out. Now, there's two credit cards I want you guys to look into applying for. So if you can't get approved for this credit card, or maybe you just don't like this credit card because you can't get like increases on it, well, they will increase it, but it's not like you can get major increases that when you finally get established, you'll be able to have like $10,000, $15,000 limits with them. So if you can't get established, you can't get established with this credit card. So let me show you the two other credit cards I suggest. Well, actually three, it's two other companies. So Capital One, they have student credit card um, for you. Now they say that they got the the Quicksilver Rewards for students, but that's for, that's for anybody. They have that. They have the Saver One, and then they also have the Journey Rewards for students. So let's go over both of them. With the Saver One, you guys will get 3% cash back on dining, entertainment, which is really good that you guys would get that. And if you guys are buying um, any tickets, then you guys can earn the 8% cash back with the company. Or if you guys are um, buying those tickets, you're going to have no annual fee, which means you can grow with the company. And usually in about six months, you can ask for an increase and you'll get it. You can ask for it right in your app. So with this card, you guys are not going to have um, a different APR, if depending on which card you're going to get. You guys are going to have the 26.99% APR. And if you want to do a transfer, like a balance transfer, then you're going to have no fee at all with that transfer. Now, a few benefits of this credit, of the Capital One cards, is that they will actually... Um, give you 
believe let me go to the journey card they will actually give you a few months yeah they give you 60 dollars streaming credit which is really nice so that's going to be five dollars per month for 12 months on as long as you're paying on time so if you're paying on time they'll give you five dollars per month for 12 months one percent cash back we already went over that and you can see if you approve for this credit card without getting that hard inquiry which is really good because you don't want to get a hard inquiry on your credit report without knowing if you're going to actually get approved. And with Capital One, they're going to pull all three credit bureaus. So they're going to pull TransUnion, Equifax, and Experian. And like I said, too, after six months, you guys will be able to possibly get that increase. Just make sure that you keep your balance on your credit cards and you're paying your bills on time. Now, the next credit card I want to talk to you guys about is Discover. It looked like I didn't actually send click it yet but here is a discover student credit card so they have two credit cards for students now with discover i really love them because again you can apply you can see if you can get approved for this credit card without the hard credit check at first if they say they can get you approved then at that time that's when you apply for the credit card so they have two credit cards you can definitely choose from one offer to five percent cash back at certain places the other, the other offers two percent cash back at gas stations and restaurants so you can decide are you always at amazon are you always at the grocery store or restaurants um if you're using paypal you guys will get that five percent cash back so that is really good and you have to see if this would be worth it for like if you actually go into these places but all your other purchases you guys will go and get the one percent cash back and that's on both of the cards so that's really good now they're going to do the cash back match dollar for dollar for all the cash back you earn at the end of your first year and they'll get it to you automatically you'll be able to get your credit score for free and you can earn uh, statement credit when you refer a, fr a friend and they are actually approved so that's really good you guys can refer a friend now for those students that um may you know you may want to purchase you want to may want to get this credit card so you can get your books you want to do anything with your um credit then you may want to get this credit card because you guys are going to get the zero percent intro apr for six months on purchases so that means you don't have to pay interest on the first six months which is really good i mean you can hold a balance you can have a balance on a credit card and not get charged any interest and that's for six months but definitely you guys definitely um see which credit card you want to apply for all of them you can pre-qualify without a credit check at all so they'll let you know exactly what they can approve you for so you have to deserve you also have the Discover, and last but not least, you have the Capital One. And Capital One, they have two credit cards that's specifically for students, and then they have that Quick Silver Rewards that you know is great for everyone. But go ahead and see if you can get pre-approved for it. Now, if you have any questions, definitely let me know in the comments. But thank you all for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. There are so many people out there with debt so much debt you guys that they can't even get a car they can't get a mortgage they can't even get a credit card like i mean a 200 dollar credit card some people can't even get a secure credit card so that's why i created my exclusive credit membership and it's only a dollar you guys so my exclusive credit membership you guys will actually get the letters to delete bankruptcies charge off repossessions any negative account that you have in your credit reports i have the letter so you guys can get that deleted but guess what just because you guys are a part of my exclusive membership you can get all those letters, but say if you don't want to do all that work, I have it so that you guys can get free credit repair. So that means I will actually start working to help you remove these accounts from your credit reports. And look right here. Look at all the results that my clients are getting. So definitely remember, you guys can join my exclusive membership for just a dollar. And I'll have that link down below. Or you guys can text SCORE21000 and you guys will have that link. So I'll see you guys in my exclusive membership.